Hello Squirrels and welcome back to PPM6 TV. Today what it is is the vexed question of gain. You see, when you have a low sensitivity mic like this uh, SEX1R ribbon or indeed <laughs> the might of a Shure SM7B, you're going to need gain and need it in spades. You're going to need to push your interface to the very limit. Let my good friend Nigel Tufnell explain. You see, most most blokes are going to be playing at 10. You're on 10 here, all the way up, all the way up, yeah. all the way up. You're on 10 on your guitar. Where can you go from there? Where? I don't know. Nowhere, exactly. What we do is if we need that extra push over the cliff, you know what we do? Uh, put it up to 11. 11, exactly. One louder. Why don't you just make 10 louder and make 10 be the top number and make that a little louder? These go to 11. Nigel Tufnell there with the wisdom of Spinal Tap and the need to get to 11. But how much is 11 in audio interface terms? This excellent uh, Audient Evo 4 has 58 dB of gain in the mic amps. Is that enough? Well, the original RME Babyface goes too louder than that. Yes, this has 60 dB of gain in its mic amps. Is that enough? Well, if you want to be really sure, Maybe you should consider this uh, gain monster, the RME Babyface Pro FS, because RME have managed to pack in 65 dB of gain into a bus-powered interface. How they do that? I don't know. But it certainly is a lot of gain. Is it five? Is it five louder? Is it seven louder? Is it loud enough? Let's find out. Now we're listening to the RME Babyface Pro FS with 58 dB of gain. Remember, that was uh, about the same amount of gain as you'll get with an Audient Evo 4, an excellent um, interface. Um, now, what exactly does that sound like? Well, what we can do is, um, using our audio calibrator, we can put some tone in here, right up against the SM7B, a notoriously gain-hungry microphone. And I'll do that with all the settings so you can get some idea, some comparison of an absolutely fixed level input and what the output sounds like. Let's move on to 60 dB of gain. Now we're at 60 dB of gain, which is what you get if you have a classic RME baby face. And uh, we're still using uh, the SM7B. And we'll put that tone generator back on just for a comparison. And finally, hold on to your horses while we engage the full 65 dB of gain available on the Babyface Pro FS. Here it comes. Here we go. I, I, this might even be clipping. I don't know. I mean, I, I can see the, the, the meters behind me, but uh, my eyesight's not good enough to tell. Anyway, here's the, uh, the tone generator for that last comparison. So there you have it, the RME Babyface Pro FS, the spinal tap of audio interfaces. 65 dB of gain in the mic amps with bus powering. How do they do it? Anyway, thanks for dropping by. I hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe. It does help. And come back soon. Bye for now.